Hello, and welcome back to me doing Don't Starve. The last time, we ended the episode a little early, and a little suddenly, but I wanted to save Woody's curse for today. His curse is the curse of the moon, the curse of the werebeaver. Now, as the werebeaver, we got to kind of stay on our toes here. Um, we've got a wood bar over there that you can see. And I've got to keep that wood bar up at 100% if I want to stay the werebeaver. And I actually need to stay the werebeaver for at least two nights. Because it's a full moon for two nights. Uh, waxing and waning, of course. And I, I turn every full moon. Eat some of these logs here to get my wood bar back up. I turn every full moon and I turn every time I uh, chop trees down too quickly. So what we're going to do... Now that we're the werebeaver for a little bit of time, I can also see in the dark. So that's being in the in the pitch dark isn't a problem for the werebeaver. What I'm gonna do, I also can't I can't open up the map as the werebeaver. So I'm gonna have to kind of try to remember where all this stuff is that I, I want to do while I'm the werebeaver. The first thing I want to do is run over here and take out some of these spiders that are in this forest over here. That way we'll have a supple supply of of uh, spider webs. We can just come down here and grab them up. Ah, what the heck was that about? Ah! <laughs> Alright, I need to stop that. Um, so we'll go up here and we'll take down these. I don't have any health or anything as the werebeaver. The only thing I'm gonna have to worry about is keeping this wood bar um, up all the way. So I'll have to eat some trees and kill these spiders at the same time. Trees, there we go, kill the spiders. Done and done. Now let's take down this spider den. And when I when I'm done being the werebeaver, what'll happen to me is I'll go back to being Woody, but I'll be at half half sanity, half health, and half food. So I'll have to worry about I'm eating trees that I don't need to eat. I'll have to worry about that as soon as that time comes which is going to be somewhat of an issue because I don't really have the food uh, I don't really have the food necessary that I need Let's get rid of, there. Get rid of the spider den the second thing I really want to do while I'm the werebeaver is run up to the quarry real quick and uh, just mine as much as I can so that I won't have to use a pickaxe for it spiders here. No, no big deal for the werebeaver. And they're, uh, they're cowering from the sunlight, as you can see that warrior there doing. Get rid of this spider den here. There we go. A few more hits. Done. And I actually, as the werebeaver, I do about the same damage that a uh, that a tentacle spike does. So... I'm not sure about my armor class. I'm not sure what my armor class is while I'm the werebeaver. But, you know, clearly it doesn't matter too much as long as I keep my, my wood bar up. And that's, that's that. That's pretty good. I'm going to go ahead and run back to the campsite and then up to that quarry, if I can remember where that is. Because like I said earlier, I can't open up the map. Um, and I hope I can get back to a wooded area before my... Uh, wood bar diminishes completely. That would be a horrible mistake. And if I if I die while I'm the werebeaver, I should probably mention this as well. If I die while I'm the werebeaver, I uh, just wake back up as Woody, where where I where I died at, which is helpful, but also a huge. Um, it's really bad if you if you die and you're surrounded by like spiders or something, because if if that's the case, then Woody's just gonna get killed by by the spiders who were left from the werebeaver. We've got some rabbits caught. That's good news. You also end up dropping all of your stuff as well. If you can see my stuff right there laying on the ground. Um, another thing we're gonna do while we're the werebeaver, real quick, is cut down all these trees um, and try not to eat them up as well. Uh, the reason we want to do this. Because when we come back here with Woody, we can just pick up all these logs and not have to worry about turning back into the werebeaver. 
uh, cutting them down. This is just a nice way to go ahead and get all these trees cut down. And if we're lucky, we'll spawn the Follower of the Forest to get that taken care of right now. But it doesn't look like we're going to. We'll worry about that sometime later, though. We'll just turn back into the Werebeaver and then go down to that forest. Got these trees, there we go. We'll get these trees right here, then we'll head up to the quarry. I'm accidentally eating wood here. I don't want to be doing that, really. Alright. Now, hopefully, I can remember where that... Hopefully I can remember where it sounded like Lucy was just talking to me. She's She gets real sad when I turn into the werebeaver. Hopefully I can remember where that quarry is. I think it's up here somewhere. But uh, we're fortunate in that... This isn't it. No, that's the forest. Sorry. The texture on the ground, it, it gets a little weird looking for me whenever I turn into the werebeaver. As you can see, there's this orange tint everywhere. Um, it's just a, a little hard for me to see. I thought that was the rock of the quarry. It wasn't. Um, Lucy gets real sad when I turn into the werebeaver. It makes her feel like she loses me. Let's see here. There we go. Get that wood back up. Here we are, back at the quarry. I hope. Because right now I'm just seeing one boulder. The rest of that boulder there. Let's see here. I'm not sure if this is where the quarry's at or not. We might... Well, we can't. Oh, here it is. I was going to say, we might have to just abandon uh, being the werebeaver, but we can't. we got to be the werebeaver for at least one more night, like I was mentioning earlier. But we found the quarry, so it's no big deal. We'll get all these boulders gnawed up. There we go. And if you, uh, if you press the spacebar in this game, it lets you auto-mine stuff. But as the werebeaver, you don't want to do that, or you'll, you'll eat everything that's on the ground, which is kind of counterproductive from what we're trying to do here. What we really need is some gold, but I can't seem to find any of that anywhere. Looks like just these rocks. We'll find some eventually, though. So it's no big deal there. Let's see here. More rocks over here. Ah, there's some gold. Look at that, because we, we still need some gold to build the uh, birdcage that we need to build. But we're also going to need all, this, all these rocks as well, so we can start building up a base. Let's see here. Here's a lot of gold right here. That'll be good. Alright, that one. Almost nighttime of day 10. And then we can go ahead and turn back into Woody. Which, before we come up here, when we turn back into Woody. Or, no, because if we just die right here, then we'll, we'll spawn as Woody right here. And then we'll just pick up all this gold and stuff. We're just going to have to be considerate of our our half hunger and our, our half health and all that stuff. There we go. It also when you uh, when you respawn as Woody, it starts you on the next day. So it's it's like you had to sleep the whole day. And see as you can see it's the the waning full moon. Get up these some logs. So we have some have some wood back. And then let's just continue mining all this out until the next day starts, and then we'll just let our our log our log meter go all the way out. Then we won't have to worry about the werebeaver for at least another 10 days. But by the time we'll have to worry about the werebeaver again, we're gonna have to worry about the the winter. Let's see here. Is there any more? Have I? Mine this place completely dry. It's starting to look like it. There's a tall bird egg. We might actually consider if I can find that tall bird. But I remember we couldn't find that tall bird last time either. Don't know where where that thing's at. But it've been would have been nice to uh, to find that tall bird and take it down. But because that thing will just be an issue later. Ah, oh, there it is. Let's get some wood back up. We'll take down this tall bird. Then we'll let our, our wood diminish. There we go. This tall bird will help us with that. Get out of here. Doing a little bit of damage to us. I hate those stupid things. There we go. Tall bird dead. Now we can pick up that egg as well that that tall bird um, has in its nest over there. And we can use that for bacon and eggs as well. Which will really help us out. So now we're just going to kind of wait around. 
shouldn't be too, too long. Uh, I'll go ahead and pick up this meat as well. That'll help us out uh, when it comes to getting our hunger back up. Might consider getting these berries as well, but nah, that'll be fine. We've got too much stuff we have to pick up. Three, two, one, and done. That was a pretty successful werebeaver adventure. Didn't turn out, and as you can see, oh, and I said half, but it actually puts us down a lot lower than half. Take this mushroom. Take this seed. Oh, and here come the dogs. What a horrible time for these dogs to come. All right. Uh, what we're going to have to do is we're going to have to say forget forget those, uh, the things we mined for now. Because we're going to have to immediately get back to camp so we can get our weapons. I I'm not sure if I'm going to make it. This might be the end of Woody right here, which would be really sad for me. That was just... That's bad luck. I've been expecting those dogs for a couple of days now. And of course the time they come is when I'm absolutely not prepared for them. Let's see here. Hopefully we can get back to camp and get our log suit and stuff and then fend them off. Because if I can if I can just get my, my tentacle spike and my log suit, then it'll, it'll be easy going for these dogs. Um, my sanity is going to suffer a little bit, but we'll just take a nap. And here come the dogs. All right, uh, we're just going to have to outrun them for just a second. Um, until I can get back and pick up some stuff. There's the other dog. Oh, all right. We're getting real close to camp, though, because ah, there's the, the wood. I'm getting ready to... Do. All right, now we're going to have to somehow manage to pick our stuff up. But uh, that's not going to work out for the best for us, so... Uh, let's, let's see if we can, oh boy, um, <laughs> alright, let's see if we can get these things to the pigs, uh, cause, uh, are, are, are you gonna, nope, okay, let's see if we can get these things to the pigs, we're gonna kite them around a little bit, uh, one of them stayed up there for whatever reason, uh, but that shouldn't be too big of a problem, our sanity's waning our health is waning our food is waning we've really got to get rid of this dog so we can deal with our food there's the other one uh best case scenario we kite them back to the pigs the pigs help us out with them and then i can set up a well no i'm not gonna be able to set up a fire either i don't have the woods and i don't have my axe with me oh boy this was bad luck all right let's get them to the pigs if we can that's uh, that's gonna be top priority for now. We just we've got to deal with these dogs. They're taking out some some rabbits right now. Maybe we can maybe we can uh, get back to our camp while they're distracted. Maybe yeah, that one's focused on that rabbit. So let's run back up to our camp as quickly as possible, and and hope hope to God we can get some food taken care of. Let's pick up these seeds. We'll eat these seeds just for a little bit of food. Oh boy. Alright. Let's get up here. Maybe we can get these seeds too and munch on them a little bit. That dog is distracted by that rabbit, so that's good. Pick up these seeds. Alright. Now those dogs won't leave us alone. They'll, they'll definitely come back for us, but hopefully we can have our log suit by then and, and have our hunger taken care of at least a little bit. Let's get back up here. And uh, we do have enough meat in or, uh, to to make a. Sorry, I heard something. We do have enough meat to at least make something. That. All right. Now we're ready for these dogs if they come back to us. Oh boy, we've got gonna need, need to pick up some of these logs here, so that we have enough to stoke our fire. Because we're gonna have to stay here for the night. Um, got the red cap and the meat. These, uh, these rabbits here that are in this trap, thanks to my sanity, are gonna be beardlings. Which, uh, when you kill them, they give you... I don't know why I put fuel in that fire. Alright, here's the dog. Equip tentacle spike. Equip the, not the breezy, be breezy vest. What was I thinking there? Drop that. Oh, run around. Pick up the backpack. Oh, not gonna work. Oh boy, look at my health. This might be the end, Woody. 
This might be the end. Six, done. All right, now we gotta put this in here. We've gotta make some meatballs for today. And that other dog's gonna come back to us at some point. But we'll deal with him when he gets here. We've got six health. Oh, eat some of these seeds for now. Oh boy, day 12. Oh, I ended up making meaty stew. Not the best, but it'll work out for us. Got our got our hunger all the way back up. Our health is still a little low, but that's all right. We'll deal with that eventually. Let's see if I can make a, let's see here. Let's see, we need to make a uh, bedroll if we can for today. I think it's in survival. If we make a bedroll, it'll get our sanity back up. That way we can start killing some of these rabbits. Go. Yeah, I might have enough actually. Uh, I know I need to make a, a rope. I think I'm gonna need ten pieces of grass. So let's pick up a few of those. Um, if I can get my sanity dealt with and above eighty, then I can start killing these rabbits. That way we'll have food again, which we are definitely gonna need to worry about. Got to make the straw roll. There we go. I only needed six grass. I was wrong there. Can't sleep because that dog's still out there. I was afraid of that see here what to do then what to do because <laughs> we're, we're about to we're about to have a huge problem whenever my food starts to go down because we don't really have any food right now uh, to combat that so we're not gonna be able to pick up these rabbits because they'll give us monster meat if we if you strangle a beardling it'll just give you monster meat um, so let's go ahead and we'll build a farm. It's in food. Ah, uh, we need five more grass. We're not going to build a farm. We're going to sit at our campfire and hope for the best. Let's see here, pick up some of this grass. We're going to have to get back up there and get that gold so we can start getting bacon and eggs going. Because if, uh, if I had enough to make bacon and eggs, then we'd, if I had my, my bird cage, we'd, we'd be pretty good. Um, we might consider actually baiting birds for a while, just so we have a steady source of food again. All right, sitting here at the camp, hoping for the best. Oh, health isn't good. We'll get that back up eventually, though. Oh, boy. Day 12, not the best day. And we're going to have to deal with that dog, too, because we don't go back down there and deal with him and we'll never be able to sleep um, hopefully we can run into some flowers on our way back up to the quarry oh boy oh boy oh thought that was a dog he'll be here he'll be here eventually don't know what he's doing down there but I'm glad we got rid of him I'll go ahead and I'll get this bird trap and I'll kill this crow I'll murder the crow, ha ha ha, and then we'll bait this trap again, hopefully get another crow. We're going to have to make another meaty stew. Um, we'll go ahead and run back up here to the quarry. We are going absolutely insane, but there's nothing for it. Day 12 didn't work out for the best there. Let's see here, here I am pressing M again. Get back up there to that quarry. Here's a carrot. That'll help us out in food. Some berries, too. We're going to want to really get all that stuff again. It's like day one again. Pick up all these flowers and stuff, too. So we can work on our sanity a little bit. Get it back up to 64. That's not too bad. But we, we really need it to be above 80 uh, so we can start killing rabbits and, and getting meat again. Because, like I said, if we kill them now, it'll just give us monster meat. But... There are a lot of carries and a carries. There are a lot of carrots and a lot of berries here, so that will definitely help us out when it comes to making food. We won't have to use as much meat as I thought we were going to, and just end up making meaty stew. We can actually make meatballs with all the stuff we have now. Pick up some more of these flowers. I don't know if I want to waste any more time picking flowers, but I don't know. It might actually do us some good some more of those flowers let's get it up to a hundred if I can I'd like to do that 
But like I said, I don't want to spend too much time on it. 99. I'll call that a win. Ooh, we gotta get rid of this thing. This thing will... This thing will grow. And grow and grow. And eventually cause us a problem later. Um, we can actually plant this fleshy bulb uh, near the spiders. And that way this fleshy bulb will kill those spiders for us and we can run down there and get spider webs and stuff. Alright, back up to that quarry. We're still still on dog watch. Gotta make sure that thing doesn't come back and really mess us up. Somehow missed all these gold, but or all this gold, but that's alright. And we're running out of room a little bit. I think we're going to run into some, some niter down here too that it'll want us to pick up. Which we're actually running out of room for. Or not. Okay. I guess we'll, we'll be able to pick it all up. That's good. We really need to build chests like I was talking about last episode. Pick up all these rocks and stuff. This is going to take just a little bit. That's alright. It'll really help us out in the future. Where Beaver Adventure, like I said, almost got me killed. I was afraid it was going to. Let's pick up all this stuff. Oh, I'm out of room. We'll get rid of this feather. We don't really need it for anything. Uh, use that feather to make a make a feathered hat. But that's all right. We don't really need it. We got our bush hat, and soon, soon we'll have our football helmet as well, which will help us out against those dog attacks. Also. Not too concerned about that other stuff that's over to the right of us. We'll get that later. Um, I'm also going to need to drop something so I can pick up that egg as well. Uh, what can I drop? Maybe I'll drop these pine cones. But we have enough to make our birdcage now, which is definitely a good thing. And now we have more gold than we know what to do with. Uh, we will not be using all this gold on... on... Uh, on tools or anything. It's just about the only thing we'll need to make thanks to Woody. I don't Niter's used for gunpowder and I don't really need gunpowder for anything. Maybe maybe traps. I might think about using niter later, but right now it's not too important. There's tons of it up here. We'll just come back and get it. Uh, thanks to Woody, I won't really need to be focusing on making tools. Just about the only tool I'll ever need is a is a shovel so I can so I can shovel up the wood stumps and get a little bit more wood. Let's see here. We, need, we, we really need to deal with our health. Once we head back down to those spiders, I, I'm pretty sure killing those spiders as the as the, as the werebeaver, pretty sure they dropped some, some healing salves. So I'll pick those up, make those into, into healing salves, and our health will be pretty good again. Once we can use our straw roll... Uh, that'll help out our health too, I'm pretty sure. Don't quote me on it, but I'm pretty sure that, that'll help us out. And we got a cardinal, that's good. So let's go ahead and make that birdcage done. Put it... Ah, oh, we'll put it right there. It could be right next to the fire and stay warm. Come on. Turns green. I might, I might say screw it. There we go. Put it right there. Pick up this bird. Put that trap back down. We might need it again. Go ahead and bait it. And then we'll put our bird, we'll imprison it right into the bird cage. Now, when we have some spare monster meats, we will be able to uh, feed that bird and start making our bacon and eggs. Murder this rabbit. Right. Maybe. There we go. Put that egg in there. Cool. This is just going to make some meatballs, so I'm going to kind of waste this egg, but that's all right. So we'll have a steady source of bacon and eggs soon. Go ahead and murder this. Ah, no, I'll just use a carrot. There we go. All right. Wait for that to cook up. Uh, tomorrow, we'll go down and see if we can deal with that. Um, deal with that dog. Because I don't think we're going to be able to sleep until we can deal with that dog. But... Our health is doing okay now. I might consider... I made tacos. Or pierogies. That dealt with the health health pretty well. That couldn't have gone better. So, 
I'm gonna end it here, I think. Next time, we'll run down there, try to deal with that dog, and then we'll finally start being able to build up our base and work on defenses and stuff, so something like this won't happen again. Whew! Day 12, not the most exciting day. Well, it was definitely the most exciting day. I don't know what I'm talking about. There's more fuel on there. There we go. All right, next time, we'll do all the things I said. Thanks for watching. Leave a like and a sub subscribe as usual if you like the channel. If you don't, nasty comments. Always like those. Thank you for watching. Bye.